Yeah, stop. Okay, so Dad, you're going to read Matthew 28. No, no, Matthew. Matthew 11, 28 through 30. Go ahead. Okay, here we go. Come unto me, all ye that are at labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and ye shall find rest under your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Amen. All right, Dad. How about you do the uh, the Our Daily Bread reading called Finding Rest in Jesus? Okay, I found an interesting portion here in the Daily Bread. It's finding rest. And where do you find it? You find it in Jesus. It's the only place you're going to find true rest. The restless soul is never satisfied where wealth uh, with wealth and success. Deceased country music icon could testify about that truth. He had nearly 40 of his albums appear on a billboard, country music, top 10 cards and charts, and just as many numbers, of number one signal. But he also had multiply marriages and spent time in prison, even with my soul that I have never conquered, not with motion, marriage, or meaning, is still there to some degree. And it will be till the day that I die. Sadly, he could have found rest in his soul before his life had ended. Jesus invites us and all of us, like this musician, who have become weary and toiling in sin and its consequences, to come to him personally. Come to me, the Bible says, and he says that too. When we receive salvation in Jesus and Jesus alone, he will take the burden from you and give us rest. And that's what we need this, this very day. Matthew eleven twenty eight. The only requirement that we have are to believe in him and then to learn from him how to live a burdened life which he provides over in John ten ten. Taking on the yoke of Jesus, discipleship, results in our finding rest for our souls. You will find that in Matthew eleven twenty nine. When we come to Jesus, he doesn't abbreviate our account or our abilities to God. He gives us peace in our restless souls and provides us a brand new and less burdensome way to live in him. He gives us true rest. Down at the bottom, they got something else that's pretty neat, so I'd add that in there too. In what ways do you feel weary and burdened right now? What's it like to experience the promised rest that Jesus offers in Jesus alone? Jesus, let my restless soul find peace and rest in you alone. For further study, Get into the Compassion of Jesus and discoveryseries.org Q022226. <laughs> okay, well, that's not exactly right, but, but that's okay. Thanks, Dad, for the daily reading of the Daily Bread.